car, corner pace truck, taking a dive off in turn two. The 017 of Alex Weber is gonna bring us around to green. Coming around, green flag and we're racing. 017 of Alex Weber. Taking a little bit of an advantage, but the 71 of Patrick Featherston the third takes it away. 97 of James Swan trying to close in on that gap. Taking that high line groove. 47 back on the track of John Featherston. Alex Weber gets a little loose. Howie Ware sitting in comfortable at third, trying to catch up with that 97 of Swan. 71 of Patrick Feathers in the third, breaking away to an early lead, but they have to sit comfortable for this long race. Here racing for fifth and sixth. That is the 35 of Brock Banky and the 43 of Christian Jansen. Alex Weber trying to close that gap with Howie Ware. Forty-three dies down low on Alex Weber, trying to take away that fourth position. Lundy's trying to close the gap on Dallas Conniff. takes another dive. Let's see if he can close this gap in three and four, and he does get a little bit further. Seventy-one, keeping that comfortable lead, coming out of four. Oh, he's trying to take away the gap that the 97 of James Swan has on that second place spot. How he does close the gap, coming in four. Jansen tries to make, take another shot at Alex Weber, taken in that third position, and he closes the gap, can he make it? Weber and Jansen keep battling it out for that third and fourth position. Jansen's knocking it down a little bit at a time. He gets a little loose. Swan starting to knock on Featherson's door. Swan gets a little loose coming out of four, but he's still making up ground. And we are coming to 10 laps to go. 10 laps to go to 71 of Patrick Featherston the second. Evans trying to make up as much ground as he can on Featherston. Still got a little time to do it. 43 of Jansen and Alex Weber still battling it out for that fourth and fifth position. 
Took a dive, but it looks like he got a little bit loose in that turn two. And we have five laps to go. Five laps to go. 43 gets into Alex Weber just a little bit. Let's him know he's there. of Sawyer, lap traffic, making sure he's down and out of the way. Forty-six of Erickson and the forty-two of Cartwright have been battling it out in the back. of Swans, but trying to swing down lower on Featherston. We are one lap to go. One lap to go. That was the one lap signal to Patrick Featherston. Oh, we have a big wreck in turn one. Big lap in turn one, and that is the five of Bobby Geyers, the 35 of Brock Banky. All right, so we did checkered flag that race and the finishing positions were Patrick Featherston the check it, or I'm sorry, Patrick Featherston the second, the 97 of James Swan, and then the two of Howie Ware. All right, he had a great lead on the pack, held the pack off for 25 laps. Let's give a big round of applause for the number 71, Autoland Outlets, Byron Auto Body, Patrick Featherston the second. All right, he tells his dad, happy Father's Day. That was a heck of a race. Let's go up here. Heck of a race. He's got a good start on the race. You held the pack off. 25 laps. $1,000 to win night. What do you have to say? Who do you have to thank? Well, first of all, I thank God first and foremost for keeping us safe and doing what we do. Happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. Um, I don't know what happened to Leahy. He just kind of slid up and the only pressure I saw coming was Swan and uh, I just like last year racing Howie I give it everything I got and was holding off but I want to thank uh, Costa's Restaurants and Pizza, Autoland Outlets, Sam's Drive-In, Advantage Auto Glass, Byron Auto Body, uh, James Gregory, Brock Mankey, my dad, um, Matt Personet, all those people that helped me come out here and make this happen. Appreciate it. All right once again big round of applause to the 71 of Patrick Featherston the second.